A very good morning, Zimbabwe. Mamuka say, Mamuka say, Mamuka say. So, once brought up on a senator defeat court heart, it is alleged that a judge hearing the CCC Blawayo 12 case today recently bought a 390,000 USD house in Newlands, reported by Nehanda Radio. If true, this is utterly scandalous. So, uh, I think this is the judge here, the Supreme Court judge and um let us try to go to to to, to this article by um uh, nehanda red so that we get the real effects i don't know if my network is going to permit me but we'll try to open this article so that we know what they really said so we all know that the judges got around four hundred thousand loans uh, recently, the M, uh, the ministers got five hundred thousand. Ma, three hundred and fifty. Ma, deputy ministers and other top officials within the government of the Republic of Zimbabwe and among my heads of departments. Then uh, we have um, uh, my MPs, uh, forty thousand each. All those issues. We can span up as twelve disqualified opposition citizens calling for change. CCC parliamentary candidates. Um, from Lawayo, head to Supreme Court in Arare for a legal showdown on Wednesday. Near the radio can review that one of the judges, Felicia Chatukuta, is a 390,000 house being bought for her in the new land of Arare by President Emerson Nangaka's regime. Not only that, the house in Cambridge Avenue in the new land is being bought via the Borodo Bed Party Shop, an estate agency owned by Mnangagwa's daughter Farai. Uh, if it gets even worse, the convincing for the sale of the property is being done by Farai's lawyer husband, Nangagwa's son-in-law, Gerald Mbochwa. From the documents gleaned by Nand Radio, it would appear Justice Chatokota already has a house in Straker Avenue in Ghana, Warari. The property is listed as her current residential address. According to the documents, we have the judge signed the offer to purchase the new house on 29 June 2023, while the seller signed the offer to sell on 26 July 2023. Uh, Justice Chatukuta is one of the judges uh, that was brought in the last minute onto the case that saw former ZANPF cabinet minister Kasevia Kasure being barred from contesting as an independent presidential candidate. After ZANPF's uh, activist Love de Mangwana successfully challenged Kasukwere's nomination, argued he had been out of the country for over 18 months. It was Justice Chatukuta who threw out Kasukwere's appeal. We carefully considered the evidence and oral submissions by both councils. The court is of the view the appeal lacks merit. The appeal B and is hereby dismissed with no order as to cause she ruled. So this is what um, Neander Radio is reporting here. He's saying that uh, Justice Chakukuta is a part of the team who is going to preside over the CCC 12 matter, but she is reported to be compromised because she is said to have received a house um, worth 390,000 from the regime. These are the allegations so far. We are going to closely look at the outcome of the court uh, process so that we know what is really happening in the nation of Zimbabwe and find answers at all costs. So Zimbabwe, let us brace up for change, let us brace up for advocate and also Chinese's leadership. Um, one way or the other is going to lead Zimbabwe because when you are destined for something, nobody can stop that. If they can't stop death of their beloved ones, they cannot stop change um, in the nation of Zimbabwe. They have all the resources, they have uh, access to, to, to foreign medical uh, health systems, they have uh, security guards, they have everything, but they die. Even if they, 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 they don't want those people to die, they die. It's because of time. The same time he, he has come to the nation of Zimbabwe. So she should recuse herself. Or if she can't, our lawyers must request that for her. Okay, so she can take the house and do the right thing. She scandalous indeed. She can't justice for sale in Zimbabwe. She can delayed marriage. She can some of the people who still need to answer to the people. So one day she can 
we are in trouble with these free buys that the judges are receiving. The timing, the amount, everything, je, is just off. So guns captured cause so guns should be alone. On the, uh, will she be alone on the bench and your party still considers to contest in such elections the fact that you are in opposition you shouldn't assume you should have first hand information okay so um team zimbabwe this is what is happening in the nation of zimbabwe and we have just given you uh recent breaking news here let us meet in other episodes and other broadcasts